Welcome back, Brown Eyes family. Happy Saturday, everyone. Okay, guys, I told y'all I would come with a little review of the um, vacuum storage bags from Dollar Tree. These are the ones you're supposed to vacuum and they will um, shrink down or whatever you want to call it. So I'm getting ready to attempt to use this bag. I'm going to put my son's 18-month uh, clothes in here until I get ready to uh, sell them. So I said I would come and bring y'all this little review real quick. So if you're interested in seeing this little review, then y'all stay tuned. Okay, you guys, as you can see back here, I have some of my Christmas items like my pillows and everything that I need to pack in one of the, um, these little bags. Also, most of the Christmas stuff is packed up, but I haven't had anywhere to put it, and I told you I ain't going to the garage, okay? So, anywho, right here it says, pack the items into the vacuum storage bag. Step one. Step two, close the bag by sliding the bag clip smoothly across. Step three, unscrew the valve cap and remove air with the vacuum. And step four, screw the valve cap back on. Directions right here. I'm going to show you what I'm trying to put into this bag, you guys. I haven't put my son's 18-month-old clothes up. Y'all see all these clothes? It's in a big old pamper box. And... They have been sitting, okay, because I have been procrastinating to put them up for sale on uh, on the um, One Man's Junk. So that's why I usually put his clothes or either on offer up and they sell just like that. But I haven't had time to do that. So until I get everything situated, I'm going to be putting them in here. So I'm going to put the clothes in here and then I'm going to come back and we're going to do this process together. So y'all stay tuned. Okay, I wanted to show y'all right quick. This is a big bag, y'all. Y'all see this big bag? Look at this. This is where my hand is right here. Look how big, how big this bag is. Oh my goodness. Y'all, if this works like it's supposed to, your girl gonna have to go back and get some more, okay? But I'm gonna go ahead and put the bags in, my clothes in, and I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, I forgot to mention that uh, I have, oh, I have like a hundred pieces of clothes, clothing. Here they go right here. <laughs> I tried to keep them folded like they were uh, when I took them out the box, but I had to like kind of smush some down off in there just so they could go. There's like a hundred pieces of clothing of um, my son's uh, clothes, you guys. Oh my goodness. So, get this together. So, I'm going to um, zip this shut. attempt to zip it shut all right uh oh the little thing came off but it's like it goes it goes back on you guys so it's back on now i'm gonna take this valve off and i'm going to start vacuuming and i'll be right back Okay, you guys. <laughs> Wait a minute, hold up. Okay, you guys. Um, either I have too many clothes in here because this didn't suck it down like it was supposed to. I don't know if it's because I have too many clothes in here. Okay, so I'm going to try this again because you know I had th I got three um three of these bags. So I'm going to try this again with a different bag. I'm gonna take half of these clothes out. And try it with another bag, okay? And we're gonna see how that works, okay? So y'all stay tuned. But right now, this is how it's looking. It's just real tight. It don't look flat or nothing, you guys. So y'all hold on. Oh my goodness. Okay, you guys. First, I'm gonna try to take some of these clothes out this bag that I've already used. And then I'm gonna see how it does using the same bag first before I go and waste another bag, you know, just for demonstration purposes. So y'all hold on. 
Okay, you guys. As you can see, I have less clothes in this bag, and everything is pretty much flat. So first, I'm going to see if I can reuse this bag again. So let's start this process over, okay? Just together. Okay, you guys. So I have done it now. Hold up. Wait a minute. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, I'm learning my new tripod, honey. <laughs> okay, so I reused the bag, and this looks a lot better than what it did just a minute ago because I was like, wait a minute, this ain't supposed Maybe I had too many pieces in it because um, on the paper, they just, have, they just have like some towels, as you can see right here. So I'm trying to put like 100 plus clothes in there. So, and thinking it's going to shrink down to the lowest possible form. <laughs> and it didn't work. But this right here, yes, it indeed sucked it up like it was supposed to. It sucked it up good enough uh, for me to be able to store somewhere. You understand what I'm saying? It's not like it was just a minute ago. Y'all see, everything is packed in here tightly and secure like the picture. So it wasn't the bag. It was just I tried a little bit too many clothes in there. That's what the problem was, okay? Just because it says large does not mean I could put a large quantity of stuff in there. But this is how it's looking. And it looks just like the picture. Let me put this valve thing back on here. It looks just like the picture, and it worked wonders for, you know, instead of having it in this daggone box right here, I can just slide this up in the closet somewhere, and, and I'm perfectly happy and fine with it, okay? So, would I purchase these um, vacuum storage bags again if I seen them? Definitely. I am going to go find some more today, okay? I'm not even playing. I'm going to go find some more of these today because these work just as well as the bigger ones um, in the bigger stores. You understand what I'm saying? These work just as well, you guys. So I am super happy about the results that I got. And if y'all don't know about these, y'all better get down to your Dollar Tree. They have them in there every time you can find them. They have them in there all the time, but they're so popular. You have to find them, okay? So I was lucky that day to have popped up on them. I'm going to go pop up on some more. So I recommend you going to get the vacuum storage bags from Dollar Tree. If this is something that you need to store your items in, you know, for a little bit more convenient way and everything, I definitely recommend these. All right, guys, that is going to be it for my little review. Thank y'all for watching and supporting my channel. With that being said, I will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.